Someone asks um, P Man 182, he says, Will Muslims ever meet their maker? Um, is heaven a creation of Allah? And when in, par when in paradise, will you still be separate from Allah? Okay, so I've mentioned this in a couple of videos before, but I'll mention it again, inshallah, from what I know. Um, of course, I'm, I'm not someone that has uh, ultimate, unlimited uh, knowledge, but I will speak from my knowledge, inshallah, and I will bite my tongue in times of uh, ignorance, yeah? yeah? So, there are some Muslims on the, day of, on the day of reckoning that will get a chance to meet Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. And Allah will look at these individuals and He will ask them, what else do you want? What do you want? What else do you want? And Allah will turn, and these people will turn back to Allah after they've been promised, promised paradise for eternity. And they will say to Allah, um, what else can you give us? Basically, you've given us the, the, the main ultimate goal that our, in our lives we were striving for. And then Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala will take his veil off whatever it is that is covering him from the people. And if it wasn't for the will and permission of Allah, these people would be scorched from the light of Allah, but Allah shades these people on that day. And Allah will turn to these people in Jannah, in Paradise, and He will say, Ya Ahl al Jannah, Assalamu Alaikum. O people of Paradise, peace be with you. So, in terms of the, for example, if you're going to go down the metaphysical aspects, for example, of um, how people can physically live near their Lord, I'm not the best person to ask about that. Okay. But what I will say is that, you know, I do know of these, uh, these narrations. Regarding, um, regarding accounts of people being close to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala in paradise. So that's, that's, that's what I could say on that matter. And yeah.